All right, from great food and family fun, this year's Enfield Italian Festival, it is the perfect spot to stop this weekend. And to find out what's new, we are joined by Carl S S Sferraza. <laughs> <laughs> I just practiced this with well, you two before we came pretty back. Pretty close, pretty close. Sparazza. Sparazza. Oh, there we go. All right. And he's one of the organizers from the Mount Carmel Society. How are you doing, Carl? Very good. Thank you. Nice it is to be awesome here. awesome to see you. Thank you, Scott. So, Dina, I remember I remember the days of Dina Martin. Dean Martin's daughter used to show up, but unfortunately, she's not going to be able Dina to come this Dina played year. with us for about eight years, and uh, she was just a phenomenal, absolutely phenomenal person to be with. And uh, her talent was second to none. Second the, to none. She really was that she's a true talent. And the guest stars we've had over the years, you know, people like Mary Wilson of the Supremes, oh, Bobby Rydell, Joe Piscopo. We had some great, great names. How and, did you get these great names? Oh, I didn't get these names. Dina's a personal friend, and she would call these chips in okay. and because they didn't play a lot of places no exactly in they played at enfield though. yeah yeah so wow. so tell us what, what we're in store for this year what's what's the what's, well, what's well this the year is our 98th consecutive year oh my wow. god oh, two years away from a big one for, huh? absolutely and you know our our festival is something that people look forward to in the summertime and unlike other festivals we don't allow food trucks to come in and that type of thing we do all the cooking on our own oh, uh, grounds god. That is wonderful. Because we want to control the quality and the and the price of the food. Mm -hmm. And you know, it's kind of like when you go to Disney World, there's an expectation of customer service at yep. Disney that's set high. Yep. So when you want Italian food, uh, our expectation is pretty high. So <laughs> everything is uh, made in the kitchen with all our members. What are we and talking, meatballs, ziti? What are we talking We about? have the standards, meatballs and sausage grinders. We have the porchetta sandwich oh. with the broccoli oh. rob. This year we're introducing um, kind of a new item I think people are going to love. They're called, in Italian, they're called arangini, but they're rice balls. Oh, I love yes. them. Absolutely love them. There's a little bit of hamburger mm -hmm. sauce, yep. mozzarella, yep. melted. They're absolutely delicious. Okay. patty cakes. I'm, I'm, I'm actually getting goosebumps <laughs> just talking about this. He's actually gaining weight right now as we're doing it. Yeah. What is your favorite thing to do and to eat there at the festival? Well, to eat is a, is a hard thing for me because there's <laughs> everything for me. But I, I'm partial to the orangini. I like yeah, those. so beautiful. The favorite part of the festival, though, is not the food. It's the ability each year, the memories growing up in Thompsonville and seeing all the people you went to school with. And, and you know, we're in such a high-tech world now where yeah. everything is social media. It's very not social media at Mount Carmel. You actually see people and you have conversations. And to see the families come in with their lawn chairs and enjoy the music, it's just a, a, a wonderful small, big community, if that yeah, makes any sense. Yeah, it does. It totally makes sense. Sounds like a homecoming or a reunion. It's kind of like a reprise from what's going... You know, the world sometimes, as you know, you watch the news and it's not always good. No, it rocks in different ways. And we know it's there, but for this festival, it's a throwback. And, you know, on Sunday morning we have an outdoor mass, and then we have a procession, uh, wow. old school, through the streets with an Italian marching band, which are not easy to find. Exactly. And uh, it's how they did it 98 years ago, and we just want to continue that tradition in Enfield. And it's very family friendly. The admission price is ridiculous. It's $3. Oh, my God. Oh my that's so And we let kids under 12 and free. So we're trying to make it affordable for families, give them a good quality night of entertainment. So it runs all weekend. And we're right off um, I-91, exit 48. And uh, we all hope right. people great. come out. We hope they do, oh. too. Carl, it's great to see you. Carl Opens tonight. There you Did go. Get it? You got it. All right. 93 Park Avenue in Enfield. Again, it runs through Sunday. The weather is going to be be spectacular this weekend. Get out there and enjoy it. Thanks, Carl. Always a pleasure Thank to see you. you. Thank you very Have much. A great and festival. tell Dina I Thank said you. hello. I will. I will. <laughs> All right, storms.